It's showtime! Hey, yo, what up, Fight Warriors? Your boy, Boxing Fanatic. I'm back with another one. According to reports, Canelo Alvarez just signed a three-fight deal with PBC and Al Heyman to defend his super middleweight titles. The WBA, WBC, IBF, and the IBO super middleweight titles against Jamal Charlo. Hopefully in September 6th. Hey, yo, what up, you guys? It's your boy, Boxing Fanatic. Back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash that like button. Don't forget to subscribe for the latest and greatest content. But um, let's get into it. So Canelo Alvarez versus Jamal Charlo. Canelo Alvarez, Dimitri Bivo had been trying to get that rematch with Canelo Alvarez and his fans to basically shut him up to prove that he beat Canelo Alvarez square and fair. He told Canelo Alvarez, he'll come down to his 168 pounds, which ain't too far from 178 pounds, where Canelo hit that roadblock facing Dimitri Bivol, in which he lost that fight. So, Canelo Alvarez, David Benavidez, has been calling him out, has been his mandatory for about three to four years now, and David Benavidez and his dad been on air, basically calling him out you know, trying to get that fight with Canelo Alvarez, but Canelo Alvarez don't want that smoke with David Benavidez. For some odd reason, Canelo said he don't want to fight Mexicans. Something I don't understand, I don't get. But hey, if you're a fighter and you got mentors and you the champion, you got to fight whoever they put in front of you. And whoever your mentor, you got to face them. 154 pounds, 160 pounds. 168 pounds and we're still calling him out David Benavidez the Dimitri Andrade David Morrell Dimitri Bevo put hands on him and Canelo Alvarez he ain't got nowhere to go now so who he, he who do he pick the fight out of everyone okay for one Jamal Charlo has been off ain't been in a fight in two years so Canelo Alvarez, don't get it twisted. Don't overlook Jamal Charlo. Now, uh, if that fight do happen, you can't underestimate Jamal Charlo because he is with all the sh you know what I'm talking about. So he don't want to face David Benavidez. He don't want to fight Demi. Alvarez thinking it's going to be an easy fight. I don't think it's going to be an easy fight. But uh, September 16th, Hopefully, um, we'll hear some news if this is accurate. We already know that Canelo Alvarez signed a three-fight deal with Showtime. I mean, uh, yeah, Showtime, PBC, and Al Heyman. Because he's going to be fighting on Showtime. So, you might as well say Showtime. And who the uh, the three fighters could be. It could either, or it could be four fighters. Jamal Charlo, David Benavidez, David Morrell. And um, he can fight Caleb Plan again. So we got to wait and see um, if he's going to really take this fight with Jamal Charlo. But the way it's looking, Jamal Charlo is next up because he's been inactive. And being inactive for two years with a two-year layoff, it's going to be some rain rush. Canelo Alvarez was off. He had hand surgery but came back and fought John Ryder and beat John Ryder. But Canelo Alvarez didn't look good against John Ryder in that fight. But he still was able to pull off the victory against John Ryder. Somebody that was already stopped, that done had so many losses. I thought Canelo Alva, hey, look, now you're going to have to kill me in this ring. You know, kill or be killed. And that's Canelo Alvarez's model. He probably, you know, don't look at it like, you know, in a physical form. But he's trying to knock you out. He's trying to get you out of there because you don't get paid for overtime. But Jamal Charlo against Canelo Alvarez man that's going to be a great fight it's going to be an awesome fight I think this fight should have happened so many years ago when Canelo had the chance to fight Canelo I mean Jamal Charlo when he was dominating 
you know, and was on top of his ish, you know, and was doing his thing. But Canelo didn't want to fight him. But here we are now. We can't go in the past. We living in the present. We in the future. The time is now. Hopefully, Jamal Charlo can, you know, start training, get some sparring in and be in tip top shape for this fight. Y'all let me know what y'all think. All right. Make sure y'all like, comment and subscribe. One love, one life. I'm out. Peace. If you enjoy content like this and you want to see more, make sure you like, comment and subscribe.